I want the religious leaders, please. Juma Ngao is a mental case. Hiyo yake siwezi ongea sana. Is a, ma, is a machine is a penini, machine gun preacher. Ni mtu ambaye hajui e, thamani ya dini. Anaongea vitu kwa minajili ya shilingi miambili miatano anaopewa. Juma Ngao is not a resident of Kazandani, muembelegeza. Juma Ngao is just a conman who goes around e, kupewa pesa na wanasiasa, aende ya peleke uvumi. I want to tell Juma Ngao, please, hapo katika iyo area yetu, tuko na viongozi wa kiislamu. Kama kuna matatizo yote, watazungumza na sisi na tukai chini na Muhammad Ali hawezi kamwe maisha yake hawezi vunja vitu viwili kanisa na msikiti kwa hivyo sasa hii mambo ya kutumia sasa msikiti yeti sasa museme Muhammad Ali amevunja msikiti ili nionekane mbaya acha ni siasa sheke wewe, wewe, wewe kama una elimu ya dini umenishinda na elimu ya dini lakini usitumie hiyo dini kufanya mambo ambayo hayakubaliki na dini leo unakuja kuzungumza unazungumza kama nini hao wote ni wazee wa mtaa how what ni wakazi these are signatories wame sign they have taken to the commissioner it has been stamped kila kitu imepokewa it has been stopped sasa unaenda kuambia watu Muhammad Ali anavunja misikiti mtabia gani hii tuko nayo siku hizi ya kwenda kutumia dini pia kama chambo cha kupata pesa so mashimamo njuma ngao is just a conman a confused character ambaye hajulikani na viongozi wengine wa kidini hatujui anaswalisha msikiti gani i don't know where he does his things sijui njuma ngao anaswalisha msikiti gani mimi na umri wake na wangu yeye ni mzee kuniliko na muheshimu lakini atumie dini kihekma asitumie dini kama maslahi i will never ever apologize to a conman by the name of Juma Ngao i will never ever apologize to a machine gun preacher by the name of Juma Ngao i will serve my people i will listen to the pleas of my people i will sit down with all residents i'll sit down with the religious leaders both christian and muslims the government officials and we decide on a best way for the people but i cannot apologize kwa conman who comes all the time kwa siasa yuko conman number 1 akienda kwa dini yuko conman number 1 akienda kwa harusi yuko conman number 1 kwa matanga yuko conman number 1 i can never apologize to him hizi pesa zimeshapeano Pesa kunua ardhi wamepewa. Hawanunui ardhi wanataka kula. Hiyo pesa ya ardhi wakijifanya wamenunua hapo. So these are the things that we are asking. Muhammad Ali will never ever. Siwezi vunja msikiti wala kanisa. Siwezi. Lakini mimi sijaona msikiti unakaa duka. Sijaona msikiti unakaa nyumba ya kukodesha. And that's why the county commissioner stopped it. MCA is another conman being used. Yeye mwenyewe kuna rekodi mbaya ya ku, kuchukua ardhi za watu akitumia ubavu wa yeye ni, ni MCA anakaa ndani ya county. Kwa hiyo pia yeye kutumia vibaya. Why is it shida yote ikitokea the first person to be on the site is MCA? Usiku MCA, asubuhi MCA, saa saba MCA. Why are we not engaged? We are leaders there. Kama kuna issue, they come to my office they say mheshimiwa kuna shida. Can we sit down and talk to your people? Tujue vile tutasaidiana. Hawajaona haja ya kuni involve kwa sababu ni wizi wanafanya na wanajua wakini involve sitakubaliana na wizi wale wameni involve ni wakazi wale ambao wanateta the signatories here nimerudia na nakuambia they are muslims in it signing these things saying that sisi hatujui ni nini from where wanasema wanajenga msikiti there is another mosque hapo kuna zaidi ya msikiti mitatu minne hapo karibu kombenzai anasema ati ukitoka hapo msikiti Ukitoka hapo kutafuta msikiti unaenda 5 km. Is he a madman? Mombasa huwezi enda hata 100 meter huja upata msikiti kila kona. At you go to 5 km. Perhaps aende ambiwe 5 km is a very long place kuwe kutembea ukwenda kutafuta msikiti. So they never involve. Huwezi sema ati mheshimiwa tumeona tusiku involve kwa sababu ni sehemu kidogo hapana. That is my territory. Those people elected me in small and big things to represent them. So kama wametuma Sheikh leo Jumangao I'm sorry to say at ya kuja yaseme at Muhammad Ali amevunja msikiti so that they can use watumie dini kuniangamiza hiyo ni porojo Juma Ngao hata mtoto mdogo hazi msikiza Juma Ngao is a political conman a sheka who is a conman mtu ana mbele wala nyuma is the same same person sijui mbona hajaenda ya Pakistan aseme pia hii ni miradi mzuri watu wakidhulumiwa 